Happy Sunday, everyone. Happy Sunday. I hope you had a, a great day, and I hope you have an even better Monday. I'm just going to share a little bit of what's going on in my life. It's nothing difficult. It's nothing really just life. So I woke up this morning feeling different. I knew that something different, like a shift was happening. I felt the shift taking place. So I decided, okay, God, whatever you say, that's what I'm going to do. Whatever you say, that is what I'm going to do. This light keeps shifting. But um, I just felt the need to step back from some things during this season. And the word that I got is sometimes you got to step back in order to step up. I'm the type that I'm content and whatever situation that I'm in, I'm not going to complain. I'm going to serve God to the best of my abilities. I'm going to do what he told me to do for as long as he's, you know, called me to do that. And it's to my detriment at times because I will forego my own destiny due to complacency. You know, we'll get in a place where we're comfortable and we'll forego our destiny. So I can't afford to do that this season, even though I I don't fully understand it, but I trust God. I trust God, and that's what faith is. Faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things unseen. So I have to move differently this season. The things that used to fly with me can't fly with me this season. I have to be wiser. I have to be more discerning. God is just showing me some things and it, I mean, it's, he's moving and I'm moving with him. I'm, I'm moving with him. I don't, you know, I don't want to fall behind him and I don't want to get ahead of him. So I'm just trusting the process, even though I don't understand it, even though I got comfortable where I, where I was. I'm going to trust him and step out and get uncomfortable because when you get comfortable, you stop growing, you stop, um, you stop pushing and pressing towards where you're supposed to be and what you're supposed to be doing. Being comfortable is not always a good thing because you become complacent and you don't, you don't walk into the fullness of what you've been called to walk into. So I'm just thanking God. I woke up this morning just with a, a newness, a newness of vision, a newness of, of calling, a newness of my mission. This year, God, the word that God gave me was purpose. Don't do it. You know, before I do anything, what's the purpose? What's the purpose behind it? So Whatever I do this year is going to be done with purpose. I'm not going to just do stuff just to do it. I'm going to walk in my purpose this year. And that means walking away from, from some things, unfortunately, and some people. That, that's what happens when you decide to walk in your purpose. You have to walk away from some people, places, and things. So I'm just giving God glory. I'm giving him glory for just being who he is in my life. And trusting me to do what he's called me to do. And being merciful and gracious to me when I don't always do what I'm supposed to do. When I'm supposed to do it. For never giving up on me. That his mercies are new each and every morning towards me. So I pray that you are, if you are in a season where you're just comfortable and you know that God has more for you, that you will snap out of it, that you will wake up and you will pursue your purpose this season of your life. Pursue your purpose. Don't get comfortable and complacent. Nobody grows when they're in comfort. Seeds have to struggle to come out of the soil. Butterflies have to struggle, caterpillars struggle to become butterflies, to get out of the cocoon. So 
You got to get uncomfortable to pursue your destiny. And that's where I am. So as I encourage myself in the Lord, I hope that I encourage you too. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Get out of the boat and walk on water. God's got you. His word cannot return unto him void. If he said it, he's going to do it. God bless you, and I pray nothing but the best for you. I pray that God crowns this year with goodness for you. Have a good evening and a wonderful week.